What's up ladies and gentlemen, this is Craft Source, and welcome back to another gameplay episode of Minecraft The Weather Rainbow Beacon Challenge. So the last time we were we did this that uh, I actually had to smelt on a lot of ores and Okay, you know what? It wasn't exactly that too exciting the last time we were here and I apologize, I just didn't have anything in plan now on the previous episode. But but this time, you're in luck, because today we're going to take a quick trip down to the nether. That's right. You heard me correctly. Today, we're going to have a quite a little stroll down across the nether, filled with lava and misery and despair and fire and a lot of things that could possibly kill you. Yep, that kind of stuff. Okay, so... As you can see here, I eventually managed to clean out most of my inventory. Well, in case if I lose anything too good within in the wall work down there, so uh no. Kinda of think of it. I should probably try to make me a, at least some bread in the meantime. You know, because since I feel like I'm gonna be hit a lot while I'm down there. There's so Oh, I think we're going to be, like, uh, a little stuck down in the nether for quite a little while. In fact, we are indeed going down there for a good cause, too, is that, uh, uh we really need those, those, those skeleton heads in order to reach the weather. And don't worry, I, I didn't for, forget about why we're here the last time. And so, uh, yeah, we are actually having a little, little trip down to the nether to see what we can find down there. And believe me, I know what it's like down there. It's cruel, it's harsh, and you, And when I mean you need to be very prepared in there, and I really do mean you need to be very, very, very prepared. Oh, and, uh, and this I'm doing right now, well, I'm just, you know, arsing as much as I possibly can because, uh, well, of all the we have spent on bread, I mean, no, I know I already got a lot of, a lot of bread on me here right now, but I just, hmm, well, I'm just trying to make up for the bread I the wheat I spent on the bread so far, so eh, right now we're gonna, gonna try to, you know try to grab a few things and we'll probably make our way down to the nether hmm, as you can see I have no iron boots whatsoever, so our plan for today is that we may have to equip with some full armor before we even go down there uh, hopefully I should be able to run into at least some um, iron as you can because uh, I actually checked the inventory very carefully uh, this time around and, and it turns out I am actually one piece of iron well mostly like one iron ingot short in order to give me exactly what I need hmm I I'm pretty sure I might be able to find at least one, one piece of ore before we go down there, so... So as soon as we're I'm done with this, we're going to take a bit of a trip down to the caves. Let's see, okay. <laughs> and I can tell the sun's already starting to go down. Hmm. Okay, um, okay, so like, uh, okay, you know what, honestly, I really, really need to get rid of these damn wheat seeds, I'm like, like you, you only get more wheat seeds than just your regular wheat itself when it comes to harvest, harvesting this stuff. <sighs> oh boy, and, uh, hmm. 
Well, oh, couldn't think of any. I have no idea why I got them um, separate, but, uh, hmm. Let's see, it could be, uh, for, uh hmm. Well, not too sure about that, but, uh, hmm. Well, I should probably uh, go to the you know, caves, uh, just for sake of it, in order to, like, uh, get my hands on the ore, in order to get my hands on the boots. <laughs> That's, like I said, though, you really need to come in very prepared when it comes to the nether. Alright, so, let's see what we can find at the meantime. Okay. <laughs> oh boy. And we got a zombie. Huh. Okay. Well, I guess we're quite a bit on a roll here. I guess. <laughs> okay, so. Let's see. Where have we been to yet? Uh. Hmm. Well. This is, uh, kind of uh oh. Is that a baby zombie? Oh man. <laughs> yeah, I can't exactly hate deal with those because they're small, they run very fast, and they got the average health about just like an adult zombie. But as long as I got this diamond sword, it shouldn't be too much of a problem. Alright, so... Uh, ooh! Ah! See? I told you! Well, we would be in luck. Alright. Hmm. Because it wouldn't hurt just to grab... Uh, take back a few more because, well, <laughs> we got... Uh, uh, got that uh, beacon in order to work upon. Huh? Huh! Well, you can even see the tall grass right on just top of you. Hmm. Uh, Alright, now we got what we need. Let's get ourselves a pair of those fancy schmancy boots. <laughs> Be quiet, you stupid phone. Yeah. Uh, uh, in these random calls. <laughs> I tell you, it's actually not fun whatsoever. Okay. Yeah. Me time. Uh, da -da 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 gonna make me a pair of iron boots because I'm about to do the nether. Okay, so while that's cooking, I still need to work on my weekly storage. But as you can see here, I actually managed to make myself a spare chest because, well, I quite ran out of room, as you can obviously see. But I'm gonna try to harvest me some, uh, some potatoes at the meantime. Yeah, you just gotta be careful not to hit the ones that are exactly fully grown yet. Yeah, as you can hear, sometimes it can be a little hard to tell, or... Well, I know we have haven't exactly had a chance in order to get into it. And that is because of, well, of all the things down there. <laughs> but, however, though, that doesn't mean I'm more of a coward than a fighter. But, if you really want something in your life, sometimes you guys have to work and fight for it. Or, it could have been and uh, work or fight for it. But, anyways, I don't make the rules here, but... Uh, 
But if you feel like my advice isn't exactly the super helpful kind, then please disregard everything I just said. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so we should be good on Teos. Now. God, I really even need to sell these to a local villager. Alright. Okay. And there you have it. Fancy Shamanshi boots for the road. Ah, there we go. Well, I could hardly say the same. I wish I could have the same thing with the, uh, the diamond armor if, if it were that easy. Huh. <sighs> but, <laughs> I guess this is gonna be it. Hello, oh, boys and ladies. Next stop, the nether. Okay, I have no exactly where the hang am I. Huh, but I think I know where that fireball came from. Oh boy. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so we got ourselves another another Hmm. Ooh. Well, there's a magma cube. Believe me guys, if you really want to try to go for something good, try to hunt down like a few magma cubes at a time. Because as you can see, I managed to whoa give me like magma uh oh hey! Oh boy. <laughs> well, you know what they say, when the going gets tough, sometimes you just gotta either fight or run. I could- Whoa, there it is! Come on. Oh, oh, come on! Uh, yeah, and the tricky is that you really need to- Hmm. Come on. Oh, oh. Ah. <laughs> yep, just. Yeah, just keep swinging. Sword right at the. Ah, my god, this is. This is actually quite a little harder than it looks. Ah, uh, you know what? Yep, screw this. I'm out of here. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. And we even got a few endermen on the ground, so that's gonna be a bit of an issue. Hmm. Huh, no, I think I might have even saw some kind of a structure. Yeah, I think I might saw some kind of structure right on. Huh, and what do you know? Looks like I'm even lucky enough to spawn right next to a fortress. Uh, sort of. <laughs> eat, eat, eat. Uh, Alright. Huh, soul sand. Well, if I am going up against Nine Wither just to build the beacon, then it looks like we're going to have to collect some soul sand as well. I don't know. Whoa! Well. Whee! <laughs> huh. Yep. And uh, you may even want to be a little careful when it comes to like, uh, like, uh, uh, uh yeah, just, hmm, I wonder what happened if I could go through. Whoa! <sighs> huh, well, no place rock, but uh, hey, at least we're actually doing good so far. Oh, 
Yep, I've been hit. I've been... I've definitely been hit. Oh, don't die, don't die. Woo! Yikes. Oh, and uh, you might want to try to, to find like a, a, a blaze fire as well, because, because out of because out of all the places where you could try to get your hands on a blaze rod, like this one for example, ooh, blaze rods. Believe me, they are actually quite very useful when it comes to crafting like potion stands. Yes. Uh, But, but, however, though, it is quite a little bit of a, uh... What? Yeah, yeah, as you can tell, these... Oh, boy. Yeah, looks like we got ourselves a, a bit of a run with the Wither Skeleton, so... <laughs> ow, 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 ow! Yeah. And... Whoa! Huh? That explains it. Oh no 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 no! No! <laughs> yep, I was burned into a crisp while flying blaze. Yep. <laughs> like I said, huh? Another is just a quick stroll down the park. And I'm definitely not gonna cut me out another time. So, whoa! Holy crap! Okay, honestly, that lava fall wasn't even here the last time. But, uh. But I'm definitely not losing my stuff. Okay. Gonna run, gonna run, gonna run, gonna run. Ooh. Okay. Uh, shoot, come on. Uh, word. Uh, okay. Ooh, like my cube. Huh, even I have to admit, the magma cubes are a little tougher than the uh, regular slime. Hmm. Yeah, mate. And I am not going in the right direction. <laughs> uh, let's see. Well, since the other men now live in the nether, well, even though they still kind of do in the overworld, just. Yeah, well, you have to come, account, come across monsters, just try to run for your freaking life! Yeah! There's a weather. Yeah. Yep, I freaking withered away. <sighs> Man, out of all odds, a bunch of wither skeletons just had to be blocking my path to my eyes. <laughs> and you can actually see why I don't even. You can actually see why I don't pack me a lot of stuff every time I... Well, technically this is our first time down in another. another but still though, uh, it's actually quite a pretty bit of a bummer, bummer once you go down here. Okay, but like I said, I'm definitely not giving up my stuff. Even if I have to face a bunch of wither skeletons. Or those. Just run. Oh, I've been hit. Uh. <laughs> it's too hard. Ugh, oh my god. I can't lose my diamond sword. Not now, nor ever.
Oh, I don't know. I'm pulling for that again. <sighs> you know, I probably really need to build me a wall there, so that way I don't have to keep running towards the cliff every time I get down here. <sighs> Goodness. <laughs> Wither skeletons, magma blocks, blaze. <sighs> Man, if you really dare to go down here, then you may have to go through everything in possible. Oh, Lord. Ooh, run away! Ah, come on! Seriously, another direct hit? Ugh! You gotta be kidding me! Oh my god. I swear. This is why I just don't go into the nether that much. <laughs> the mobs are the only thing standing between you and the. Alright. Obviously lost. But this is actually gonna be my one last shot. Uh, goodness. I came too far in order to back down from this now, and I am never going back from scratch. Because believe me, it kinda did took me a little while in order to get my hands on. Excuse you! I'm trying to get my stuff back. Oh my god, it's so damn hard! Okay, this time... Hopefully I shouldn't be able to go through any more mob problems. Yes, I know, this is kind of feeling a little cheating, but still. Everything from another is just designed to kill you. Even when you try to come in peace. <sighs> well, I think my arms probably disappeared already, but I'm just gonna have a look just to be sure. Because I cannot take another fireball or another or blaze or pretty much anything or pretty much anything else. <sighs> come on. <laughs> God, yep. Maybe going down here was kind of a bit of a mistake. Oh. Well. <gasps> Aha! Ah, man. Never thought I was going to be able to see myself again. Huh. Boop, boop, boop. Oh my god. It's, yep. Believe me. This is what you have to deal with every time you go down here. I know it doesn't look fun, but, uh, <laughs> and, hey, nonetheless, if you want to try to go for something a little more calmer, just try to switch to peaceful mode if things kind of do get a little rough for you down here. And, uh, and I think I lost my blaze rod, didn't I? Oh man! <sighs> Must have got burned up in the fire. <sighs> so, anyways, I think we might have everything that we need. I guess. Hmm. Well, and it looks like I actually did. I found a way in order to, in order to get up here. <laughs> um. Hmm. Well, I don't know. Exactly. This is supposed to make things any better, but <sighs> yeah, let's just ow. <sighs> uh, oh, oh my god. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I know it's quite like a bad. Yeah, it's quite actually a bit of uh, a. <laughs> Well, that's a bit of a trouble here, ladies and gentlemen, but... Uh... Yeah, can you actually excuse me for one second, ladies and gentlemen? I'll be right back. Uh, sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. I kind of had a little talk with my brother, who... Well, rudely interrupted me. But... 
<sighs> but, however, though, at least I should get all my stuff back. Well, barely. <laughs> Oh, well, okay, that, uh, uh, well, that was actually quite some trip into the Z nether. But I assure you, ladies and gentlemen, we will get this. Is, uh, with their rainbow beacon done. Just picture it though. As the blooming. As it shines upon the sky. It will be a beautiful. It will be as beautiful as the day I built it. But. Uh, in the meantime. Uh, let me just gather a few things. I will. Try to end the video right here. gentlemen uh yeah i think this is actually where we're gonna be able to end the video like uh, uh hold on <laughs> so yeah i think this is actually where we're gonna be in the video right here so if you actually did enjoy what you see and enjoy what you see and if you want to see more videos like this then be sure to Leave that big fat thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And I'll be seeing all you lovely people out there next time. Peace out.